Welcome to another delicious edition of Foodie Friday. This morning we're excited to introduce you to a charming new addition to our local food scene, Crum & Co. Roadside Stand. We're joined this morning by the co-owners to tell us more. Good morning, ladies. Good, Good morning. morning. Thank you for being here. So yeah. first of all, what should we know about your business, Crum & Co. Roadside Stand? Um, it's kind of the brainchild of two stay-at-home moms. Okay. Um, kind of in the, the part of life where you're like, wow, Love being around my kids, but what is there for me too? <laughs> yep, been there. So yeah, so yeah. So basically we put our heads together and we've been trying to do some more local things. So we it kind of worked out and we live kind of like two minutes away. So perfect. Yeah, from each other. So it worked out. Yeah, yeah it looks like it looks great, smells amazing. Tell yes. us what you did bring today with you. So I brought um, a loaf of sourdough and then I brought two different types of cinnamon rolls. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. And so at your stand you feature yes. kind of different businesses, right? So tell us uh, what your role is and your business, how that comes into play. Yeah. So we are obviously co-owners. So we kind of help each other out and just make sure everything's in order, um, getting new stuff from vendors and just making sure it's always stocked. Okay. Yes. Great. Mm -hmm. So yes. what kind of vendors are they? So we have a variety of vendors. Mm -hmm. We have um, a gourmet marshmallow lady. We do have a little girl um, named Joe who makes gourmet popcorn and she puts it in the sand so uh, yeah supporting local young entrepreneurs which is really awesome um, we have somebody that makes honey or collects honey um, and we have uh, soaps ranging from uh, floral and just a little bit of everything for everybody yeah a little bit of everything mm -hmm. showcasing different parts of the community too, yeah so mm -hmm. it's kind cool. of nice yes yeah. because you can literally like walk out your door and find that your neighbors do such amazing things yeah and sometimes you don't get to see what they do so it's kind of nice to highlight known names and then also people that we don't know yet so Very cool. Cool. about what you do we've seen yeah. on social now you've had some special cookies <laughs> yes. yes I pretty much have done every single type of flavor that mm -hmm. you can think of um, and my big motto is butter and love yeah so <laughs> that's my thing um, whereas yeah she does more of the sourdough kind of aspect of it and sometimes we collab on that stuff too yeah okay. um, oh, nice. so we do like you know the fancy cookie oh, so she'll yeah. bake yep. the croissants I'll put my cookie dough in nice. it and it is just yeah yeah that kiss. sounds amazing we have some yeah. pictures too that we'll show in just yes. a minute here um, and we were zooming in on those cinnamon rolls there so um, where can we first of all where can we find you like physically and then where can we find you on social media too yeah so we are located in Barry Mills um, right kind of near Fox Hollow area mm -hmm. on OA yes. and then we are on Facebook and mm -hmm. Instagram as well. Okay yes. yeah we've got your location and your hours up there on the screen. Um, anything else that you want people to know? Um, just get out there and support local. Um, there's so many talented people in the area. Great and shot right there. By uh, the way. Yeah, there's your stand. It's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> there these I know. Are. Somebody was like, "Hey, how did you guys get up after that?" I'm like, uh, "Not very easy." <laughs> um, so, but yeah, we are constantly trying to bring you guys and with the vendors um, new variety um, stuff that they bring and they know people that can bring in stuff and yeah there's just a little bit of something for everyone and during this time you know when you know groceries are you know the prices that they are and whatever it's kind of nice to help out your community that might need a little extra something okay. um little on the side you know yeah. so mm -hmm. so it's kind of a nice thing i have a quick question here was mm -hmm. this a love from uh, maybe your mom your father your, your your grandparents or something like that that this came from so mine is <sighs> I wouldn't even know how it started. I think I got asked to do desserts and whatever. My, I didn't, I didn't have like the homesteader kind of typical. My mom, you know, worked and did all that stuff. Yeah. So it's kind of a different avenue for okay. me. But um, I think that. Yeah. yeah, I grew up on a farm, so yeah. mine is like homesteading yeah. <laughs> for sure. Uh -huh. So it's kind of like a little bit of both. Yeah, that's so. And we kind of bring. Mm -hmm. A different aspect and it kind of works that's how it works mm -hmm. yes it's because we're kind of two different people brought awesome. together yeah so, great yeah. collaboration so, yeah. it looks amazing and yeah we can't wait to check you out and hear your motor so awesome. thank you so much yeah for thank you for having us thanks no for having problem. us appreciate it stay with us we're yes. back right after this